boys, what's going on? It's Carl or NTNS Media here coming at you with a YouTube video. I'm making YouTube videos again. Uh, I just wanted to drop a quick one about the GTA Online update that's coming August 11th, so next Tuesday, only a couple days away. Um, Newswire just dropped a new article about kind of what's going on, so that's really cool. Um, I know most of you guys are car guys, so I'm just going to kind of read through the update and then we'll get to some of the car stuff, uh, wish list, speculation, all that stuff. Uh, first and foremost, we got, I think this is a new muscle car, correct me if I'm wrong. It looks like a Dodge Daytona. I think you guys will correct me in the comments if I'm wrong about that, but hopefully this guy uh, comes in nice and early with a nice, nice big wing. Eh? Mm? Nice big wing? That'd be cool. Anyway, make the most of the remaining dog days of the Southern San Andreas summer with a host of new activities hitting GTA Online next week. Featuring everything from intense new co-op missions launched from your super yacht to the track-based thrills of new open-wheel races to a fleet of new vehicles to require and much more, Summer in Los Santos has something for everyone. So that's cool. Nice diverse update. Um, looks like most of the missions are going to kind of be focused on the yachts and the nautical nonsense. So uh, it says, Galaxy Super Yacht owners will be able to engage in all new series of missions, either alone or with up to three shipmates. Everything from deep sea diving to high speed hijinks in the high seas. There's action for sailors of all stripes. So that's cool. We got some new yacht missions coming in. Uh, hopefully they pay high so that we can get all these, these new whips that are coming into the game. Um... And then we also have some new adversary modes. So between deliveries and sales, the upwardly mobile mobile can take to the streets in new business battles in some surprising locations for serious rewards. The Diamond Casino and Resort will also see a range of adversary modes taking place on the premises. So that's cool. You get to get to fight it out on the, the Diamond Casino turf. Um, but now we're getting into what I'm sure most of you guys are here for. If you're here from the, the streams, you're probably a car guy. So uh, meanwhile... Auto websites will be flooded with more than a dozen new vehicles to purchase, including rides for Benny to customize. Boys, we got some new Benny's cars. Let's go. Off-roaders, tunable sports cars, and a pair of new open-wheel beauties. Uh, push them to the limits in a series of new open-wheel races or design your own street circuit with the new open-wheel race creator. So we got we got some new cars coming in. That's awesome. Over a dozen? I, I wonder if they'll... Well, I wonder if they'll come in all at once or if they'll trickle them out anyway plus a number of general improvements and fixes as well as our ongoing series of weekly special events and bonuses to take part in over the coming months once the los santos summer special hits gta online on a log a august 11th august 11th <laughs> once the los santos summer special hits gta online on august 11th Stay tuned to the Rockstar Newswire for more details as well as more info on what's to come later this year when Heist Return and GTA Online's biggest ever update. So that's awesome. Uh, let's go to the car stuff. I am pumped for this update. I'm imagining that all the more than a dozen new vehicles won't come out all at once, but they'll probably, uh, probably trickle them out like they normally do. Um... We got new Benny's cars, boys. Let me know in the comments if you think it's going to be more lowrider or tuner focused. Obviously, I'm a huge JDM tuner car guy, so hopefully there'll be some cool cars. I'd love to see like a, a an FDR X7 would be huge. Um, Evo 8 or 9 would be awesome. Maybe a 240. Uh, S13 with the pop-ups would be really cool. Um, and you guys know I'd, I'd love to see an RSX or DC5 Integra, but I don't think that's uh, I don't think that's too likely. Um, but we got Benny's cars coming back, so that's cool. Um, we got off-roaders, tunable sports cars, so a couple, couple sports cars as well that uh, maybe won't be Benny's cars. So that's something to keep an eye out for. And then we got these new open-wheel cars that this one looks absolutely insane. Um, I'll probably end up trading in the, the open-wheel car that I do have now for this one if it's faster. Um, it's all about competing, so I definitely want whatever the, the fastest car is. Um, but this thing looks like an absolute beast, so I'm really excited for that. Um, and then it says down here, uh, stay tuned to the Rockstar Newswire for more details as well as more info on what's to come later this year when Heist return? Heist return? I didn't know Heist went anywhere. Maybe there's going to be a new Heist? Mm -hmm. That'd be really cool. Maybe uh, maybe some bigger payouts, because I think the, cas the Diamond Casino was the most recent one, right? And that one had the most, uh, the most lucrative payouts out of any of the, the Heists so far, so um, that's really cool. And I think that's it. Oh, and you know, I gotta plug the idea for drift tires. You guys who are uh, who are chilling on the uh, on the stream have probably heard me say before. I really think GTA should do drift tires. I think they should make a drift compound um, that you can slap on your car, get some good slides, maybe hang out at Revline, Redline, Revline, Rev Limiter. You know what I mean. 
um, a little bit longer and get some get some good real skids in there. Uh, I love mashing the handbrake on a on a banshee just as much as anyone else. But uh, I would love to actually get some some drift tires in the game. So maybe this is the update. Who knows? Probably not. But who knows? Um, but anyway, guys, thank you so much for uh, for stopping by this quick little update video. Just wanted to run through this real quick for everybody. Um, if you haven't already, you know where to join the nation. It's down below. Links down below in the description for the Discord, the Insta, and the Twitch channel. Uh, I stream every Monday, Wednesday, and Friday from 2 to 6 p.m. Usually playing Forza Horizon 4 and GTA 5. So uh, if you're into that, come hang out, say what's up. And uh, I will see you guys in the next one. Peace.